All right, this is something really, really cool that I've just found, and I'm kind of excited to show you this because it's really, really cool. So I've got a Raspberry Pi. It's running both of these, but just pretend this window is your quote-unquote attacker, and this one's your iPhone. Now, you can set AirDrop up from a Linux machine to any Apple device. All it needs is Wi-Fi, which is very, very cool because it runs in a Python script, and I can run it on this Raspberry Pi and then send it to my pretend iPhone. So I'll show you this, how this works. I've got it set up perfectly, so let's go on our attacking machine, quote unquote. I'm just going to type in open drop, find, and then my internet interface, which is WLAM0. It will come up waiting for receivers. I'm now on my receiving iPhone, and all I'm going to do is set this up so it receives, so one second. The following command does so, and if we hop back over to our Raspberry Pi, you'll see it comes up with the name of the device and an, in a blah, an index. So this is seeing my iPhone. So I had to modify the script a little bit earlier to make this work properly for sending text across the network, but basically I can now do open drop send dash r zero dash f and then my file i.txt. Now this will send hi.txt over the network, except there's an error, one sec. Maybe I have to put my interface on the end. Yep, that was the case. You can see upload successful, and in the background, file received. And if we close this down, do an ls. Ooh, what's this? <laughs> I can send files, and not just text files, you can send anything, from a Raspberry Pi to an iPhone or iPad. That is incredible. I love it.